I'm Rob Hillesheim with NTS Tire out of Redwood Falls. We're currently down here at the Hefty Brothers Farm in Baltic, South Dakota, working on a project with Michelin. We're installing an inflation system and changing out tires on their 8R370 tractor, going from radial tires to VF tires. This is Sean Higgins. Uh, he's with Michelin. He's kind of the head of this project here with the Hefty Brothers. Sean, do you want to just kind of talk a little bit about what Hefty is going to be doing here with the tire inflation system and the uh, VF tires? That... Absolutely. Uh, so what Hefty will be doing is running both at the standard pressures and at low pressures and comparing to see what are the differences in yield. We already know from our historical research that we've done over in Europe that that yield portion is the biggest uh, impact financially to a farm operation. When you look at a front fold planter uh, like this DB setup with this ADAR, the CTIS makes a lot of sense here because we've got a big shift in weight and speed. So when we're folded up and we're running at top speed down the road, you've got a lot of weight on that back axle of the tractor, a lot of weight on those four mains of the planter. We get to the field, we open up, we can see as much as 10,000 plus pounds shift off the back axle of the tractor. When that happens, uh, we need a fraction of the air in those tires. Typically, you're stuck with having to set a pressure for the worst case scenario, and that's gonna be running on the road. So now we're gonna have the option to have the very best performance when we run on the road, and even better performance and full utilization of that Michelin UltraFlex technology uh, when they're running in the field. So we're excited to see how that turns out. Absolutely. and. So when we talk about the benefits of this, just from a yield aspect, we're, we're talking a great amount of dollars. How about benefits on fuel? I mean, have we seen large benefits as far as fuel consumption when we're in the fields, taking less power? Yeah, absolutely. So uh, what we typically see is a 10% savings in fuel. We'll see a savings both in the field and on the road. So we've got a smaller contact patch, less rolling resistance, and really that tire wearing optimally when we're on the road. Conversely, when we get to the field, we want to lay out a long footprint. We want the softest uh, impact to the soil that we can get, and we want less slip. You know, we've got a lot of rising costs in natural resources. Tires are no exception. They've seen a lot of price increase during the pandemic and during all the situations globally that are happening. We normally see a 20% increase in tire life. So there's a lot of areas where a farmer looks for a return on this investment. He's making the very best use of his technology and getting the most life out of that investment on his farm. Perfect. So this is Ken Broadback with Precision Inflation based out of Des Moines, Iowa. Ken, you want to just kind of explain which, what we're doing here on this tractor? Yeah, this tractor has the RDS system from PTG from Germany. Uh, what it allows us to do is put a rotor union on the shaft, affix it to the uh, tractor housing, and the blue portion of what clamps to the uh, axle, and then that spins. This is static and then your airlines come from here. We have a unique system where we have two airlines that go to the wheel, and this third is a yellow line, which actually tells the computer what the pressure is here, so it knows when to turn itself on and off. Ken, you guys have been dealing with PTG, um, which is a German-based company for quite a few years now. Can you explain a little bit about PTG and the quality of, uh, of work that they do? Certainly, it was a family-owned company. Uh, they started 30 years ago. Uh, Martin Tigges is the founder of the company. He invented this uh, black and blue RDS and patented it uh, 30 years ago. They're still using it today. Uh, everything's external. If there's any issues, you can actually work on it. They have ISOBUS capability where we connect to the tractor's ISOBUS and run a uh, planter and th two axles on the tractor, all each in a separate pressure zone. Or you can run this with their own control box in the cab. Okay. And one thing that really impressed me when I first heard about PTG was uh, how many hours you get with oh, having to worry about maintenance. Can you kind of explain a little sure. bit about their 10,000 hour? Just what you said there, Rob, 10,000 hours. Uh, these are all pre-lubricated. There are no zerts. There's no maintenance to these fittings. Uh, the beauty of what PTG offers compared to a couple other competitors is it's a two-line system. We put a wheel check valve in every wheel. 
so that the only time these airlines are charged is when you're either changing pressure up or down or if you're checking pressure. Otherwise, there's no pressure in any of these lines, so therefore there's no friction on the, on the seal itself. And that allows to, to have very little friction and very long life. If it's a single line system, there's always pressure against those seals, which creates heat. And then also, if there's any kind of an air leak anywhere in the system, you will lose your air, or you lose your tire pressure. With us, it's sealed, you can't lose the air pressure. So let's say something happens out in the field, a rock hits an airline or something along those lines, there's no downtime. Uh, you're not gonna have a flat tire, you're gonna be able to continue to plant, you just need to replace that airline at some point. Correct, say you lost your hydraulic compressor, uh, we leave the original air fittings in the wheel so you can take air in and out, check pressures uh, just the way you do today. Uh, if the system is not working, you can actually uh, still increase the pressure, decrease the pressure by hand if, if it would be that kind of a emergency situation. We don't run into it, but it's possible. As far as you know, as far as competitors go with air inflation systems, PTG is the only company right now that has that two-line system. As an aftermarket, this is the only one out there. Okay. Well, Ken, on behalf of NTS, uh, I'll be the first one to say thank you for everything that you do for us as far as uh, help and support. You're welcome. Thank you. So if anybody has any questions on tire inflation systems or some of the data and research, uh, NTS actually teamed up with AgriVial Research out of Gibbon, Minnesota, and uh, we have his information posted on our website. We invite you to check that out at ntstiresupply.com. We are excited to be part of this Hefty Brothers project. We are looking forward to seeing the data and the research, uh, which is accumulated through Hefty Brothers. We're also excited to be part of this with Michelin and with Precision Egg. So thanks for watching.